Hello everyone, I hope you're okay and safe at home. We are in the factory in Omolkwen and uh, we're bringing you this uh, virtual experience to give you a uh, first-hand tour on board uh, our, uh, our boats and we will be starting with the Oryx 379 as you can see here, this lovely Oryx 379 and uh, Mr. Paul Gray, Chief Operating Officer at Gulfcraft he will be giving us his tour Hi Paul, what's Hi, yours? Hi. Okay, welcome to um, the Gulfcraft facility here in Omolkwen in the United Arab Emirates um, and this is the Oryx 379 which was a new release, a new launch for um, Gulfcraft at the Dubai uh, boat show uh, last year. And this year we were due to launch a, another configuration, a new style of the Oryx uh, with a twin cabin setup. So we thought we'd give you a, a virtual tour of the um, twin cabin setup because it's a, it's a boat that we're particularly proud of. It is um, uh, one of the smallest in our range, but um, it's, it's definitely uh, a very significant um, uh, model for us. Okay, so moving through the cockpit area here, we've got the um, pretty standard grill unit, uh, barbecue. Uh, this uh, model, in fact, um, comes with the generator as standard. Um, so, uh, a lot of features on this yacht are standard. Um, the helm position can move to the shockwave seats, they're standard. Um, the, the 17 inch uh, Garmin screens uh, with the digital switching system is all standard. You see the controls for the Mercury engines here, uh, throttles as we all, all know. Um, one feature on this yacht uh, as an option is the sky dock feature, which keeps positioning of the, of the boat uh, through, uh, through GPS um, and, and keeps you stationary where, where you ask the yacht to be. One of the features are on the console here, we have um, the HDMI and charging points within the uh, locker, our fusion, um, sorry, JL audio on this yacht, um, entertainment system, standard compass obviously, and the helm position is really nice on, on this yacht, looking out through the screen. Um, the hard top is a carbon fibre hard top, we do quite a lot of carbon fibre here at uh, Gulfcraft, um, mainly to reduce weight um, across the yachts. Everything you see here as far as the supports um, is all done in-house. Everything is done here at Gulfcraft. Uh, the, the table leg support, the table itself, the uh, transom gates, the perspex, um, everything aside from the screen you see here it is, all, is all built in-house by uh, Gulfcraft. Right, yes, on the inside, if we, if we move down through the cockpit area. And we have a nice, nice spacious saloon here. It's um, quite nice as, as far as um, the, the table is concerned. Quite a spacious saloon and a nice high low table here, which um, obviously goes all the way down to create um, an extra bed um, with the um, extra cushion that goes in there. A nice uh, Sony TV there, which is, is standard. Moving into the um, into the galley area, we have a, a drawer, Vitrofigo uh, drawer type fridge with the um, the Siemens hob and um, a microwave. Just behind the um, entry steps, uh, there's a there's a second crawl space cabin. So in there we have the the uh, shower and toilet area which is quite spacious for a, for a boat of this size. And then the, the main feature on this 379 number seven is the, is the new forward cabin. So I don't know if you want to go in there, Mahmoud. There's a, a couple of wardrobes in there. In a, in a, in a, in a yacht this size, um, the, the headroom is, is, is great. And um, it, it is again another feature of, of the Majesties. Uh, when you look at the the, the 2.2 meter headroom that we get on on a lot of the um, in a lot of the cabins, a lot of saloon areas, so um, certainly um, on this on this yacht, um, we wanted to make the headroom one of the features, um, and obviously the the exterior, exterior style of the, of the yacht has has, uh, has helped that, but um, you know, equally inside, it's, um, it's it's a great yacht. It's a great feeling. It feels very very spacious. Um, and, it, and it's, it's, a, it's a nice boat, it rides really well. 
Um, as we said, the, the railings are all done in-house, all the fit rails are done in-house, the grab rails are done in-house. Uh, the ST deck in with the Oryx logo we have here. So we have these nice proper cleats, all standard on, on this yacht. The JL Audio speakers are standard. And uh, a nice, um, a nice look to this yacht in particular is the is the colour scheme with the the red cushions contrasting the, the black and, and white of the uh, the hardtop supports and the uh, radar rail. Okay, so this is uh, commonly what we would refer to as an, an engine room of the 379. So we have the the cola generator, which is a uh, standard on, on this yacht. Uh, the, the water heater is there. The master fault chargers standard toolkit which we supply with the yachts, um, electrically operated hatch. Obviously uh, we listen to everybody, we, we take on board that, we, we, we are looking at uh, continually improving the product 